Hello our students, how are you? Uh, today we will study maglev train and hyperloop train, the newspaper and all the parts of it, and the parts of computer, and finally we will do a revision on them. Let's do it. Between the wheels and the track. The solution is to take both these factors out of the equation. It sounds like science fiction, but trains that do just that really exist. And they're called maglev, which stands for magnetically levitating trains. There are no overhead power cables because the power source is built into the track. There's no friction from the wheels because, well, there aren't any wheels. The train is designed to float 10 millimeters above the track, so the only resistance it has is air resistance. Okay, maglev train. We saw in the video that maglev train, it works by using magnet, which makes the train float above tracks. Okay, number two, it depends on the repulsion force between the powerful magnet. Maglev train have advantage and disadvantage. The advantage of the magnet train, it can move very fast. Yes, certainly it's very fast. More than 480 km per hour. Okay, it ensures a smooth ride. So, if you ride it, you will feel comfortable. Okay, number three, it doesn't cause pollution. It's very clean for the environment. Number two, for the disadvantage, it's very expensive to make it. Hyperloop, it transports people and goods through large tubes very fast. If you see this picture, it works through a tube, okay, or inside a tube. It does it depend on ripple force between the powerful magnet like the maglev train. The advantage of it it moves very fast 100 km per hour. It doesn't need much energy, it doesn't cause pollution. It has this advantage like it it's so expensive and it's difficult to build. Okay, okay let's answer some question of the booklet of this topic. Number one, put true and false, maglev train moves very fast, almost 1,200 km per hour. False. Okay, number two, maglev train makes pollution. False. Number three, a hyperloop doesn't need much energy to run. Yes, true. Complete this sentence using these words, fuel, Powerful float ripple. Number one, maglev train works by using ripple magnet, which makes the train float above tracks. Number two, maglev train depends on ripple force between the powerful magnet. Number three, a hyperloop the train doesn't need much fuel to run. Very good. The correct answer: a hyperloop transports people and Throw large tubes very fast. Goods, cars, planes. Goods, very good. Number two, maglev train moves very fast, almost 480 km per hour. Number three, maglev train doesn't cause pollution. Number four, hyperloop depends on ripple or attract force between the powerful magnet ripple. Let's learn the part of the computer. Number one, the screen or the monitor, it's a good device. It allows the user to see the result. We can see anything on it. The keyboard, it's used to enter data into the computer. Okay, number three, computer case. It's very important for the computer. It consists of central processing unit. Okay, or CPU. CPU, we can say CPU or Central Processing Unit. It is a brain of the computer. We are human, we have brains to think. Okay, 
but the computer the brain of the computer is CPU okay the motherboard it connects all the parts of the computer with each other memory we have memory also in our phones okay memory it stores the short data it stores the short data okay not the long short data storage or hard drive it stores the long data let's answer the exercise of this topic number one use these words to answer cpu the monitor motherboard memory or ram allows the, sh the user to see the result هتبقى the monitor number two store the short data هتبقى memory or ram number three connect all the parts of the computer هتبقى motherboard is the brain of the computer we said before that we have brain and the computer have brain which is called CPU excellent correct answer number one allows the user to see the result the monitor number two stores the long data the hard drive excellent number three is used to enter data into the computer enter data a keyboard yes number four is the brain of the computer CPU chapter three which is called connection with community we will study the newspaper and all the parts of the newspaper newspaper it's a weekly or daily sheets that means we can see it every day or every week contain article or news okay let's know the part of the newspaper number one headline headline it is a title of an article that means i have a subject or a topic which i want to write about okay uh, which is the title of this topic about what this is called the headline that means the name of the article or anything i will write about number two the byline which is the name of the reporter okay the name of the reporter or the writer it exists under the title headline we can find a paper of the weather it contains the case of the weather okay and all the temperature of the weather number four sports news it contains the sports news such as football volleyball anyway number five advertisement we can see a page for advertisement for any product okay like mobile phones computer anything like this picture it's a, an advertisement about an perfume okay advertisement about a perfume news famous persons such as Muhammad Hinizi this is um, a famous person so uh, I can write many news about him and about his new films okay let's exercise number one a newspaper contains sports news and announcement only false byline is the name of the reporter true a headline is the title of an article in the newspaper yes true the uh, using these words name tennis headline the pilot sports news such as tennis and football number two a newspaper contain headline which is the name of article number three is the name of a reporter yes the pilot is the title of an article headline okay uh, let's do the match advertisement yes here because it's an advertisement about an perfume the wizard yes this is picture of a wizard let's focus on it okay we can see the sun and the rains news of famous person sure Muhammad he need let's answer some question about all the things which we talk this too okay 
Number one, choose the correct answer. These two magnets will each other attract or repel. Okay, first ask yourself if these two magnets are like or dislike. Yes, that's right. They are dislike or different. So they will attract each other. Number two is a movement of object from one place to another. Motion, speed, temperature. Yes, motion. Number three, origin means the place or things where anything be exist or agree or tall. We said before that organ are the beginning of anything. So it's the place or thing where anything be exist. Number four, it lifts up material from the ground. Wheel or bucket or exhaust pipe. Okay. Yes, bucket. That's right. From the tractor. It's a part of a tractor. Okay. And number five, human begin their lives depending on themselves or their parents. Yes, their parents, sure. Number six, acacia trees have to stop animals from eating the leaves. Acacia trees have thorns, yes. Number seven, this picture of a cab of tractor. The cab of tractor is used of what? It's used to protect the driver from vibration and noise or lifts up material from the ground or prevents the fumes from reaching the driver. Yes, protect the driver from vibration or any noise. Okay. The stem of water lily plants are long and to fix the plant in the mud. Flexible or short or thick. Yes, flexible, excellent. Number nine, we can stick a note to a refrigerator or fridges with magnet, toys, string. Yes, magnet. Ten, one of the disadvantage of bicycle is, I said before, that anything have advantage and disadvantage. Advantage is a good thing okay but this advantage is a bad thing or a bad result one of the disadvantage of bicycle is very expensive or slower than car sure slower than car number 11 water lily plant has pick and round waxy and thorny all the previous answers that means pick round waxy and thorny so the the right answer here so the right answer here all the previous answer water lily plants live in salt fresh hot water fresh water number 13 gasoline cars are cause pollution and calmness or noise noise yes number 14 any object needs to move force soil fire force shoot a maglev train depend on force between the powerful magnet attract or repel yes repel number 16 acacia tree have very long roots to reach water absorb sunlight protect the trees from the animals roots under the tree so it helps it to reach water very good false number one maglev tree makes pollution no it's very clean number two trucks carry heavy goods yes the car keeps the environment clean yes number four technology is a tool designed to solve problem sure yes number five Magnets are used to keep wallet or boxes closed. Yes. Number six. Magnetic field 
is responsible of only pushing away? No, it's responsible of pushing away and repel. Okay. Number six, magnetic field is responsible of only pushing away. No, it's responsible of pushing away and attract. Number seven, all magnets have five poles. No, all magnets have two poles, north and south. Excellent. Complete these sentences. Okay. Number one, spin spins to allow the tractor to move more easily along the ground. What we say about the tractor? So wheel very good number two you can communicate with other without meeting by phones and laptops very good number three patterns of clothes like striped plain and shaped the hedgehog have to protect itself against enemies the hedgehog have Spines. Five. The tonic of giraffe help it to reach the leaves. Number six. The pelican eat small fish. Number seven. Polar bears have plover to keep them. We talked it before at the activity. Okay. Polar bears have plover to keep them warm. Question is very easy. Okay, write the type of each peak. I want the kind or the type of the peak, not the name of the bird. Okay, number one, this peak is spoon peak or scissor peak or twizzer peak or clothespin peak. Twizzer peak, that's right. Very good. Number two, this bird or this peak is Scissor peak, yes. Number three, sure, spoon peak. Number four, close pen peak. Okay, we talked about before how to calculate the area. Area equal length times width. Okay, the area is the biggest something. Length and width are Length and width are the smallest thing. So area equal length times width. Width equal area divided length. Length equal area divided width. Okay. Let's answer this problem. A wall painting has a width of 4 meter and its length 5 meter. Calculate its area. Area equal length times width. So area equal Length 5 meter times 4 equal 20 cubic meter. That's right. Match all the picture with its name. Number 1. X-ray image. X-ray image. Number 2. Searing and ample. Yes. Number three, autoscope. Very good. Number four, thermometer. Number five, yes, blood pressure cuff.